Then using water and some jeweler's plaster, it gets mixed together to create almost the same consistency as pancake batter, and then gets degassed in a giant vacuum chamber, removing any air that may have been added from the mixing. Once that's done, it gets poured into the flask with our pieces on the inside, fully submerging all of it, and then sits for 20 minutes to harden. It then gets placed into a hot oven for about 12 hours, melting away the inside wax, leaving behind an empty plaster mold. The next morning, my tombstone copper bars get added to a crucible, we remove the flask from the oven and then load it into this machine. It then heats up to over 1000 degrees Celsius to melt the copper bars. Before turning over and getting poured into our empty plaster mold. Then gets removed from the machine and cools off. Then any of the remaining plaster gets scraped off of our piece, followed by a quick pressure wash to make sure it's all gone. Next, it sits in some jeweler's pickle for about 30 minutes, just to settle. And as you can see in this time lapse, the copper actually starts to brighten, which then